Hi, this is Craig with Mobile Monkey. Today we're talking about the Bot Builder. This is the place in your Mobile Monkey dashboard where you actually build your bot. I'm going to give you a quick overview, show you where things are, and how to get started. All right, so we're going to go over the Bot Builder, and in order to get to it, you just hit this green button. That's going to bring you right into the Bot Builder. And we're going to go into the Dialogues tab here. And I'm just going to explain to you kind of what everything is, where everything is. I'm going to bring these out and I'll tell you why in a second. So on this side, you've got all your tools. If you click on any of these, it's going to expand and it's going to show you what's inside those sections. So right now, when you hit dialogues, this is where all the bot building happens. This is where everything that you do you're going to all your management of your dialogues everything is done here so you've got your three main dialogues here then we've got some folders you always have a default folder to start with but you can add new folders by clicking this little plus button and typing in a name and you can add a folder you can also drag these folders up and down which is really nice and then inside the folders you can have dialogues and again, by adding, hitting this little button here, you're going to be able to type a message, that, type a name for a new dialog, and then it's going to add it here. Now you can also pick up the dialogs and move them up and down, and even move them into different folders. So that's real nice. And another thing we can do with a dialog is if you hit these little three dots here, you can clone a dialog or delete a dialog. So if I clone this dialog, You'll see it drops it to the bottom and it calls it copy of, you know, whatever the name was. And I can go in here and change the name. So if you have a very complex dialog with a lot of widgets on it and you only need to make a simple change, you can easily duplicate it or clone it. And then you can go here and make all the changes that you need. And now you've just saved yourself a lot of time. All right, up here we've got our widgets. These are the main widgets that you're going to be using. The text widget, image widget, and the quick question widget, and the gif widget. This form widget is a pro feature widget, so you can on you'll only see that, or you'll only be able to access that if you have the pro version. Now, if you hit more, you're going to see two more pro versions. We've got connections and emails, and you can find out more about these in the other tutorials and see if those are going to help you or something you may need. I think you're going to find these really exciting to be able to help you build better bots. Now, we also can put attachments right inside the, the main area here in your dialog. We can add attributes. We can add galleries, lists, navigations, typing, and video. These are all things like if I click on this, it adds it right into the main area here and I can drag this up and down and I can also collapse these. So let's say you have like 20 different widgets in your dialog, you can just collapse them and you can drag and drop this a lot easier and organize them a lot easier. Now moving over to the right here, we have a button that tests the dialogue. So as you're building this out, you want to test it, kind of see what users are going to see. Make sure everything's flowing correctly. Um, so you do that with this. The Q&A is a question and answers keyword that allows you to add any keywords you want to any dialogue. So if someone types that keyword into the dialogue or into the messenger, it's going to pull up the right dialogue. And think of all the words that someone might type in to make sure that you'll be able to send them the right dialogue. Now the next thing I wanted to show you is you can collapse these by just going to this little arrow. You can bring them in and out. And what that does is it gives you more space in the main area for you to build your dialogue, which is really nice. And then over here, this just pops out. I kind of like to leave it like this, and it, it's, it's a lot easier to get to. And I like to have a big space here, especially when I'm working on my laptop and I don't have a big screen. And that's all there is to the dashboard.
So there you have it. That's the bot builder. It's where you'll build your bots and you'll spend most of your time. If you have any questions at all, you can leave us a message in our group or send an email to support at mobilemonkey.com. Hope that helps.